it somewhere. Can I just like hide forever, guys? I'm gonna read this note. I'm just gonna... No, I keep pressing the wrong button. Oh, this is where you got to and then stopped? Oh no, so you're not gonna be able to help me anymore? Remember to peek corners. How can I remember everything at the same time? I have to remember to reread my notes. I have to remember to record my footage. I have to peek. I have to run. Hide forever in the flooded gross basement. Yeah, that's what I want to do right now. <laughs> Mm. Okay. Let's see. On Wednesday, 10th of February, 1954, hypnotic experimentation research work was continued in building 13 of the Mount Massive Preserve in Colorado using the following subjects. One, a post-hypnotic of the night before, pointed finger, you will sleep, was enacted. Mrs. Jackson and Pierce immediately progressed to a deep hypnotic state with no further suggestion. Miss Pierce was then instructed, having previously expressed a fear of firearms in any fashion, that she would use every method at her disposal to awaken Miss Jackson, now in a deep hypnotic sleep. And failing this, she would pick up a nearby pistol and fire it at Miss Jackson. She was instructed that her rage would be so great that she would not hesitate to kill Jackson for failing to awaken. Miss Pierce carried out these suggestions to this the letter, including firing the unloaded pneumatic pistol gun at Jackson and then proceeding to fall into a deep sleep. After proper suggestions were made, both were awakened and expressed complete amnesia for the entire sequence. Miss Pierce was again handed the gun, which she refused, in an awakened state, to pick up or accept from the operator. She expressed absolute denial that the foregoing sequence had happened. Oh, God. Why would you guys make me play more spoopy games? Are you really enjoying this that, <laughs> that much? <laughs> uh... <laughs> of course you'd rather watch people spoop themselves because it's easier when you're watching. A crowd of broken men watching a dad, a dad channel. They're watching dad channels. Um, they look like patients. They survived whatever happened here, but nobody's home. So they're dumb. Alien isolation is pretty spoop. <laughs> I'm texting Jason. <laughs> um, also doesn't help that I can like hear people talking outside my apartment right now. They're going to come in and murder me. It doesn't really let you, like, effectively peer without, like, basically sticking your head out. So it's like, what's the point? Can he see my... Wait, he wouldn't be able to see my night vision. Isn't there someone down here? I'm scared. Can I just hide? How long should I hide for? Just until Jason comes back? <laughs> Do I need to hide? I'll have to soon. I can't even see. Do I have to hide after I do this? Do I have to hide now? <laughs> okay. I'm just going to hide for like ever. If that's all right. Uh. I can't see what's going on, but I'm too afraid to shine my camera. How long should I wait? He'll find you sometime? What? Are you serious? He'll find me? 
How do I know when he's gone? I know I have to hit more buttons, but... Is he in this room right now? Like, how do I know? Ooh. Should I just guess? Uh, <laughs> I'm scared too. Trust me. Oh my god, no! No! <laughs> oh, run! Open the door! Close it! There's nowhere to hide in this room! There is literally nowhere to hide in this room! Okay. <laughs> What the fuck is this? I'm too scared to move. When can I go? Like, he's probably still pretty close, right? This is really dark. Uh, hold on. I'm scared. I need a second to like breathe right now. <laughs> I don't know how I dodged him. I'm lucky. Oh my god. Fucking terrified, guys. Like, I need like 30 seconds to breathe right now. <laughs> Honestly, like, when we played Layers of Fear, I was pretty spooked, but this like takes the cake. Like, there's no doubt. It's way scarier. Way scarier. <laughs> yeah, at least I got more batteries. Oh my god, what the fuck? You're not supposed to exit. Give me one more second, okay, please. Whew. I hope the battery's not running down while I'm reading this. Soma next? No way. No way. <laughs> not alone, at least. I won't play it alone. <laughs> mm. Okay. I'll hold on. Ooh. The stalker games? I haven't heard about those. What are those like? Give me... I, I want to read your answer before I go back to it. So just tell me about it quick and then I'll go back into it. But I definitely don't want to like leave my battery running in case it's a fucking problem. Because <laughs> I want to know if we should put it on our list. After a second disaster, as if Chernobyl's not already fucked up enough, right? <laughs> Whew. That, I assume it's full of, like, fucked up, messed up, mutated things, yeah. Doesn't uh, Soma have some weird, like, space-time anomaly shit, too? I think I've watched someone play all of Soma, but I can't remember. Is that the one in space? Someone tell me. That's where your name comes from? Ah. Uh. I thought it was underwater like biohazard. Maybe I thought it was like some, it was like a space station that ended up underwater. I can't remember. I remember watching it though and I remember them being underwater. <gasps> no! No, there's nowhere to go. Oh my god. I'm scared. Is this far enough? Is this far enough? Will he find me? <laughs> Will he find me? <laughs> I ran all the way out of the basement because I got scared. Oh. 
I need to hit some junk down there. I know I do. I know I have to hit some junk down there. I should be okay. <laughs> oh, my poop. Whew. That is actually like legit terrifying because you know you can't hit them. So it's just like, what do I do? You know? Like, what if he's still here? I'm scared. God, he's, why do I have to do this alone? Can't I just play something else until Jason gets back? Like, I'm super worried. Yeah, but if I crouch the whole time, won't he catch up to me? Wait, am I just going in a circle? Wait, what the fuck? Don't slam the door so loud, fuck. I swear I heard him. I think he's in here. Oh my god. Uh. <gasps> no. No. <sighs> I am a big baby. I don't know why, but like I'm having a really hard time playing this. Like, really hard time. <laughs> I honestly don't know if I can. Like, I'm pretty fucking spooked. I don't know if you guys have seen, but I'm, like, hiding in every single corner. Like, I may have to play something else until Jason gets back because this is, like, this is legit terrifying, especially when you're alone in your apartment. <laughs> What's the best thing about spoops ga spoop games? Being alone? I'll keep trying need to push yourself not to lose your shit i think i'm way past that point i've already lost my shit <laughs> like i'm way past that point already it also doesn't help that i can hear little kids and like people running down the hall and shit like there's a lot of creepy shit going on i have the lights on well it's not complete blackness in here but it's not very bright either i have like one lamp on and that's it so, okay, it's just a game. Can I change my battery? Uh, is that this? It seems like every time I fucking go through this door, he catches me. He's like, I see you, boy. Wow, he's still there. What the fuck? Like, this is not fair. Wow, I just cornered myself. I just cornered myself again. I cornered myself and, like, left the basement again. Oh, my God. Find the button. See, that's the thing, though. I'm trying. I, like, literally, what could I do when he was standing right there? Like, that was my only exit. Like, he's literally standing everywhere that I need to be at, like, all times. So I've been through the first two. Wow! Why does this keep leading me in a circle? I'm so confused. Where am I missing buttons? Wow, okay. See ya. Can he not fit through here? Like, he's just gonna be fucking... 